What are some of your favorite uh, bloody MMA and bare knuckle fights that you've seen over the years? Uh, because more people than I uh, thought were interested in that subject. Yeah, and I did a little um, a little quiz on my Instagram too, and had people send in some of their favorites. Um, so one of the ones that kept coming was uh, BJ Penn and Diego Sanchez. Um, that's always one that people remember. That was a pretty bad cut on that one. Um, so that was a top one. Uh, there's a boxing match, uh, Jack versus Brown. And that's the one where like the ref shirt is so, it's like the bloodiest boxing match ever. Like the ref shirt looks like there was just a whole murder scene that happened. Um, numerous Muay Thai fights I can think of, but just so many Muay Thai f fights where people's just faces are gashed. Um, and then now with bare knuckle, which is pretty much every weekend, it is gruesome. A lot of these fights because, and that's another reason I decided, I don't know if I want to do bare knuckle anymore because now people are, are having this, even though it doesn't seem like its own skill set, like it actually is, but, um, man, like people's eyelids are getting gashed a lot of times and they're like hanging off of their eyes. And that is freaking horrifying. Like that is, I think that might be besides like if someone were to pull my teeth out. Oh, why am I even saying this? This is terrible. That would be my worst nightmare. <laughs> but those are my top three. Thank you for watching the Hannibal TV. Please like this video if you enjoyed it and click the subscribe button to not miss any of our latest shoot interviews, match videos, or news updates. Follow us on Twitter at The Hannibal TV for instant updates.